let me show you the basics of how to bend a 30 degree offset. Starting at the end of the pipe, I like to make my first mark at two inches. I just feel like that's a nice average size, I mean measurement. Then you'll make your second mark at double the obstruction. So this one in particular is three inches. That's why I added six inches and made my second mark. Now insert your conduit with the first mark on the arrow of the bender. Once you have it there, you can go ahead and bend it all the way down to 30 degrees on the bender itself. Notice how the conduit lines up parallel with that 30 degree mark. Now that your first bend is done, rotate the conduit 180 degrees and put your second mark on the arrow. A lot of newer benders have that second arrow right on the head so that you can line it up right there. Once the arrow is lined up with your mark, this is a very crucial step. Make sure that your conduit is straight in line with the bender and then you can go ahead and bend that one down to 30 degrees also. Now go ahead and pull that conduit out. You need to double check two things make sure that the offset is parallel with the original pipe and it is and then roll it to make sure that there's no dog leg meaning it will tail one side to the other if there is you can bend it back and that's how you do a 30 degree offset